Hi, I'm Guy Cook, and I want you to understand that the Baldy browser has a feed reader that's built in that is, in fact, a 23-joule stem-winding wonder of technology. Let me show you how it looks. If you're on YouTube, you'll see what I'm saying. If you're listening on the way to work, well, then make a mental note to check this out when you get home to the computer. Okay, so you go to the page that has an RSS feed, and you're going to see the little icon up in the top. And I'll resize this window to make that work. Okay, so your address bar is going to show you the page that's got an RSS feed built in. And there's the icon that you want to look at right there. It says Page Offer Speeds. So you click on it, and there's a happening speed with the RSS, and there's a comment speed. So we're going to show you what the happening speed looks like. And you click right here, and there's the feed. This shows you the most recent posts that have been into that content on the Happenings blog. Okay? And then you just identified that feed with this little icon on the left here. You can see other ones I've got added in. But the Route 6 Happenings blog, it's right there. And it's the easiest cake way to do it. You just, you find the feed in the page. Then you go and add that by clicking on this little plus sign. So it adds to the web panel. And you got her done. The Vivaldi News Reader lets you set it up for what your interests are rather than what you've been doing like in, you know you go to Facebook and so forth they pop ads into your content and this one is pretty much you see what you want to get because you pick the channels okay just kind of like the old days of television you picked what's on and what's hot and what's not and there you have it also check out the guyrcookreport.podbean.com for a link to the Google document that I've got understanding Vivaldi feed reader and it's got chapter and version and the step by step instructions written up in that. Hey, to contact me, use the secure contact form on guyrcook.com. If you like this episode on YouTube, and give it a thumbs up on youtube.com and click the bell to subscribe to future episodes. It's a wrap.